yo what's going on guys this is Kak back here with another element jam video and in today's video guys i'm going to be showing you guys how to get every single plaque on animal jam classic before i do get into that though i just want to quickly talk about today's video giveaway which is for this silver headdress right here all you have to do is leave a like on this video and then go to the video link in the description below and follow further instructions over there yeah let's talk about plaques and how you can get every single one of them so as you can see here i have every single plaque in my den except for two that i will explain every single one individually and how you can get them all so first of all i will be talking about the golden plaques or the original plaques So here are all of them here on the trade list. So I will go through each of them individually now. So first of all, here is the online safety plaque, which you can get for completing the online safety quiz in the conservation museum or in the chamber of knowledge. All you have to do is complete the quiz. And once you get all answers correct, you will be awarded this plaque right here. Next here is the artist plaque, which used to be awarded to people who submitted their art to AJHQ through the art studio and got it featured on Jammer Central. Unfortunately, this one is now discontinued and is no longer distributed. So it is actually impossible to get other than trading in game. Next here is the Howl plaque, similar to the Artist plaque. It's now discontinued and you used to be able to get this by submitting a Howl through Jammer Central and your Howl actually get featured. But as I said prior, it is now discontinued. Next here is the AJHQ plaque. Now these are somewhat still distributed, I'm pretty sure, on the Alamo Jam Instagram page if you win a contest or if you're just featured on the Alamo Jam Instagram page. And usually when you receive one of these, you will also receive it on Alamo Jam Mobile. But that's usually where they're distributed. So you just have to enter a contest on the Alamo Jam Instagram page and you could have a chance of getting this if you're featured. Next here is the contest plaque. This used to be awarded on the Daily Explorer. I believe if you won a contest on the Daily Explorer, you would be awarded this plaque. Unfortunately, this is also discontinued now because they don't do contests on the Daily Explorer anymore. Next here is the Epic Den plaque. I believe this was actually discontinued distributed initially to one person because they asked for it from AJHQ and it was one of a kind for quite a while until Alamo Jam started to distribute it to people on I believe live streams as well as they featured dens of certain people on their Instagram page as well as on the Daily Explorer they would actually be sent the epic den plaque it seems like this is also discontinued now because it hasn't been distributed to someone in quite some time I believe but still a cool plaque all the same next one here is the video plaque also discontinued you used to be able to ask questions to Brady Barr or Tierney by submitting a video question and if your question was actually answered in a video if it hadn't been answered before you would be awarded with this plaque in game. Certain Jambassadors also received one of these in their Jamograms presumably just for their YouTube videos but other than that that is the only way you could get this plaque. As said prior it is now discontinued. Next here is the news crew plaque. I actually covered this beforehand in my video about the news crew if you want to go check that out. Out. This is also discontinued, but you used to receive one of these if your article was featured on the Daily Explorer and you would also receive a news crew badge. Unfortunately, this is also discontinued now since the discontinuation of the news crew program. Then finally here, this is the reward plaque. You're probably wondering this is just another Howl plaque and you would be right in saying that in terms of the image. However, the name is different. This is actually an unreleased item that was originally going to be the item for for all of these plaques you see on screen right now. However, this one here was the only one released. There are other versions for every other plaque right here with the name reward plaque, if that makes any sense. However, a few of these actually got in game, presumably when Alamo Jam was featuring people's howls, and that's the only reason the howl one was actually released to people. However, it is only few of a kind on the game nowadays. Next up here are the diamond plaques. Now these plaques here were actually taking place of the normal gold variants of them and essentially retired the old ones except for the AJHQ one. However, these were mainly distributed on the Alamo Jam Daily Explorer page. Now the diamond news crew plaque, also explained in my news crew video, just took the place of the news crew plaque and its gold variants. And it has been discontinued since the discontinuation of the news crew program. Next here is the diamond jam 
Hammer art plaque. Now, I believe this was distributed to people that were actually featured on the Daily Explorer and had their art featured on there. Maybe on the Alamo Jam Instagram page, I could be wrong in saying that. And maybe if your art was featured on Jammer Central, I could also be wrong in saying that. However, it took the place of the normal artist plaque after that was discontinued. Then here on the Diamond Jammer Snaps plaque, I believe this was actually distributed to people also on the Daily Explorer. If their screenshot was featured on a article wrote up by HHQ, that's why it's called Jammer Snaps, but it just looks like the diamond variant of a normal HHQ plaque. And that is all of the diamond plaques. Next up here, i just going to dub these as revamped plaques because this pretty much took the place of all of the other plaques that I just talked about. And these are the only ones you legitimately can only receive nowadays and are still in continuation. Unlike the others, all of them, most if not all of them, have been discontinued. So starting this off here is the positive player plaque. This is usually just distributed to people if they're seen doing acts of kindness on the game, as well if they're featured on the Alamo Jam Instagram page for doing exactly that. I think they're also released alongside the community contest plaque if you win one of these, but we'll get into that in a second. Next here is a community fan art plaque. This is if your art is featured on the Alamo Jam Instagram page. They'll usually send you one of these plaques in game. Pretty straightforward stuff. And then also the community contest plaque. Same story kind of goes if you win a contest on the Alamo Jam Instagram page and you're featured, you will win one of these plaques. Now, this isn't all of the revamped plaques. There are other, there are two other plaques that I don't have. Have, and that is the Jambassador plaque as well as the Videographer plaque. And as the name implies for the Jambassador plaque, that's only distributed to people that are a part of the Jambassador program. And the Videographer plaque is apparently awarded to people with over 50,000 subscribers. However, it's also awarded to Jambassadors from what I know. However, that is pretty much finishing us up here on the revamped plaques. Now for the last plaque set of the video here, this is the Eco plaque set. Now this is pretty straightforward stuff. You get these in tiers of putting Eco items in your den. So this would be Eco wind turbines, which would generate Eco credits. And then you could use those credits to buy more Eco items. And the more Eco credit score you have in your den, the more you will, you will progress upwards and get each of these plaques. Now it starts off with the wood Eco plaque and then it moves on to the silver Eco plaque and then finally onto the gold eco plaque. Now after receiving the gold one it does say that there are other rewards apparently coming soon so there could be one in the future we don't know that yet. However that's all of them there pretty straightforward and easy to get if you have an abundance of eco items. Then the last plaque here for this video is just the giant rare plaque. I figured I'd include this because technically it has plaque in the name. And this was awarded, I believe, on an Alma Jam box. And if you bought that box, you get a promo code. And if you redeem the promo code, you would just get this item on Alma Jam and Alma Jam Mobile. Pretty straightforward. But with that, that's going to end the video here, guys. Hopefully you guys did enjoy today's video. I had a lot of people actually question me on this plaque collection I have here over the last couple of days. So I figured I would actually throw in a video for you guys for those that are, are curious. But yeah, as said, that's going to wrap up the video here, guys. Make sure to subscribe with notifications on if you guys do want to be notified on future videos as well as videos just like this one. Make sure to leave a like if you did enjoy today's video and let me know what you thought of it in the comment section below. What is your guys' favorite plaque out of all of them? Mine's personally the Jambassador plaque. Striving for that, maybe someday. I don't know. But I'll catch you guys in the next one.